You ever tried to play Halo Infinite on Linux and when you go to ProtonDB, the page tells you that is and go and it actually works and then you get hit with this logging error. Well, you're in luck because uh, I troubleshoot this myself and I actually got it to run. I don't know what causes this, but last year this game was working completely. Like it was just running regular and I don't know where one day it just decided it wanted to be a fucking cancer in my ass. So I just troubleshoot it and the solution was kind of like, it was easier than I thought. It was something so stupid. I'm like, why didn't I just think of this? But anyways, here's the tutorial. Present day. <laughs> Present time. <laughs> okay, so you're gonna wanna comment to click on Steam settings, and then you wanna go into interface, and right here where you see enable GPU accelerated rendering web views requires. You click that, and then you're gonna have to restart your app. Just wait for it. Whatever, and then relaunch Steam or whatever. Now we're going to relaunch Steam, and then we're going to go to our library. I'm probably going to change my Proton, because I thought before I was convinced that it was like the Proton I was using. But now that I know that I could just use Experimental, so we're going to close that up. We're going to hit play. Just wait for it to launch. And it should actually let you log in. And I'm, I'm like last time where I thought I teach people how to troubleshoot things. People always question because I don't run the game and etc. So I'm actually going to prove you that it actually works. Just bear with me. Okay, now that the shaders decompile, whatever it always does. Now you can see that when we go here, there's the Xbox thing. And now I'm going to lock in my credentials. So uh, let me just log it in. All right, so now when we hit the logging, see it says, let's go. All right there, authenticator server, etc. Just wait for it to load. And as you can see, the game had actually loaded and you can get past the screen. Now right there, I got my car, my setting. Everything is just working as intended. And I'm gonna go into the menu so you guys can see that it actually freaking works. <laughs> okay. All right, well, let me put this in high. All right. Okay, I'm just going to promise just access this. Just go to the game screen. I just want to show that it actually works. Oh, I wonder if it has DLS has. I guess not. Well, anyway, as you can see, the game actually works. Um, yeah. That's pretty much it. As always, if you enjoyed this video or found this video helpful, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, as always, stay spooky, stay weird.